Hi everybody and welcome again to our Power Ads from Zero to Hero course. In this video, we're going to start working on the design of our application. We basically are going to identify the screens that we will need to build during the process. So let's get started. Okay, so let's start with the design of our application. So let's focus first on the home screen. Our home screen is going to have different sections. The first section will be the header. Remember that in the header we have some buttons and actions we can execute from there. Let's write header here. We also have a top section where we show the filters to filter the different customers that we have. This is going to be the top section. Let's call it filters. And then we split our screen in two sections, right? We have this uh, left section, which is going to have the list of customers. And also this right section that is going to show me the list of opportunities based on the customer that I have selected, okay? So those are the four main sections in my home screen. Let's put a name to this screen. This is going to be the home screen. Then we need to identify the different actions we can execute from this home screen. One of them, for example, will be the action to add additional customers. From the top in the header section, we have this button. We also have a button to add opportunities, right? If we go to the customer section, remember that in this section we are going to show the list of all the customers and from each customer we will have three possible actions. So we will have the possibility to view, delete or edit. The same will happen in the opportunity section. We are going to list all the opportunities from the customer that has been selected and here we will have the possibility to view, delete, or edit an opportunity. Okay? So let's start with this particular action. If we click on this button, we are going to launch another screen. This screen is going to be the new customer's screen, right? Let's put the name here. This is going to be the new customer screen. Now, if we click on this button, we also will launch another screen. This is going to be the new opportunities screen. So we have new opportunities. Great. Now let's see the different actions that we have here. We know that the delete action is not going to open a new screen. It's basically going to open a pop-up where, where I'm going to confirm if I want to delete a customer. The same is going to happen with this action in the opportunity section as we saw in our demo. So let's focus on the other two actions, view and edit. So let's start with edit. When I click on edit, We will not open a new screen. We will actually open the same new customer screen, but obviously with some adjustment, right? So in this case, we will just launch the same existing screen. So let's call this screen new and it, or edit customer, right? The same is gonna happen with this edit button. If I click here, I'm gonna open this existing screen, so this screen will be the new or edit opportunity screen. Okay? Then we have these two buttons. We have the button to view customer. This will open a new screen. This screen will be the screen for view customer. And the same is going to happen here. When I click on this button, I'm going to open another screen for view 
opportunity. Okay? Now, remember that from this section, I also have a button to open an action plan. Let's put this here, let's say plan. Okay, we have this button. So when someone click on this button, right, we are going to open a new screen, which is going to list me the action plan from this particular opportunity. So we will have this here, which is going to be the action plan. Okay, so by now we have identified all the actions from the home screen. Now we need to go to the other screens and identify if there are additional actions. So let's start with the new customer or the new opportunity. From these screens, when we submit the data, there is going to be a success screen. Basically, it's going to be an informational screen that will tell me that the item let's say the customer or the opportunity has been successfully created or edited so both will launch the same screen so this is gonna be my success screen and then we go to the action plan remember that from the action plan we will have different sections as well Basically, we will have a top section with the information of the opportunity and we will have this bottom section with the action items. From this section, we will have two actions. We will have this action to add a new action item and we will have the edit button, right? Both are going to launch the same screen. This is going to be new or edit action. I think we have most of the screens here, but there is one additional screen we are missing. Remember that from this section, from the opportunity section, we have a button that will launch another screen to manage all opportunities. Okay? So if anybody click on here, we will launch our last screen which is going to be the all opportunities screen this is going to be all opportunities screen okay that was all for now in my next video we're going to continue working on the design of our application we will put focus on the data sources that we will need in order to build our app if you enjoy the content, please don't forget to subscribe, comment and share this video with your friends. Hope to see you again. Bye.